Hello, and welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss Golden Retriever Dog Complete Profile, including its personality traits, facts, and some of the most asked questions and answers about this dog breed. So, let's get started. The Golden Retriever is one of the most popular dog breeds in the world. Golden Retrievers excel at retrieving game for hunters, tracking, sniffing out contraband for law enforcement, and as therapy and service dogs. They're also natural athletes and do well in dog sports, such as agility and competitive obedience. Here are some of the facts and personality traits of Golden Retriever dog breed. Weight range, male, 65 to 75 pounds, female, 55 to 65 pounds, height withers, male, 24 inches, female, 22 inches, energy level, average, lifespan, 10 to 13 years. Colors, golden of various shades. Golden retrievers are very versatile. They're known as bird dogs, family pets, service dogs for the disabled, and search and rescue dogs. Personality and appearance. The golden retriever is even tempered, intelligent, and affectionate. Golden retrievers are playful, yet gentle with children, and they tend to get along well with other pets and strangers. These dogs are eager to please, which probably explains why they respond so well to obedience training and are such popular service dogs. They also like to work, whether it involves hunting birds or fetching their guardian slippers. History In 1999, the Golden Retriever was the second most popular breed. This ranking is no surprise, because the dog has many qualities that make for a perfect family pet. The Golden Retriever was bred to be a bird dog, particularly for hunting waterfowl, and the breed resulted from crossing a number of other breeds thought to include spaniels, setters, and the Newfoundland, and perhaps even a bloodhound. Exercise Needs They are known for their loyalty, companionship, and trainability. But Golden Retrievers are also active dogs who need plenty of exercise. A daily walk is a good start, but Golden Retrievers also need room to run and play. If you live in an apartment or don't have a large yard, you may need to take your dog to the park or enroll in a dog walking service. Golden Retrievers also love to swim, so if you have access to a pool or lake, that's even better. Just be sure to supervise your dog while he's swimming, as they can tire easily and may not be able to get out of the water on their own. With regular exercise, Golden Retrievers will be happy, healthy dogs that bring joy to their families for years to come. Living Requirements A Golden Retriever needs to live inside near the people he loves most. They see themselves as part of the family and need to be treated as such. Luckily, Goldens are not bothered by noise, commotion, and activity, making them very tolerant of children. With proper introductions and training, Goldens can be trusted with other dogs, cats, rabbits, and other animals. Grooming and Shedding Requirements Golden Retrievers are known for their beautiful golden coats, which can range in shade from light to dark. But what many people don't realize is that Golden Retrievers require a fair amount of grooming to keep their coats looking healthy and shiny. Depending on the individual dog, daily brushing may be necessary to prevent mats and tangles from forming. Golden Retrievers also need to be bathed regularly, and they should always have fresh water available to drink. In addition, their nails should be trimmed regularly to prevent overgrowth. A dog shedding is a natural process that helps to keep their coat healthy and clean. The amount of shedding varies depending on the time of year, as well as the individual dog's health and age. For example, golden retrievers typically shed more during the spring and fall months when they are shedding their winter coat. Additionally, golden retriever puppies and older dogs often shed more than adult dogs. Shedding can be minimized by regular grooming, which helps to remove loose air and prevent matting. Here are some of the most asked questions and answers about the Golden Retriever dog breed. Is Golden Retriever a good family dog? Goldens are outgoing, trustworthy, and eager to please family dogs, and relatively easy to train. They take a joyous and playful approach to life, and maintain this puppyish behavior into adulthood. These energetic, powerful gun dogs enjoy outdoor play. What problems do Golden Retrievers have? Goldens are prone to allergies, skin problems, cancer, and hypothyroidism, and you may have to spend a fair amount on vet care over the life of a Golden. 
Common inherited health issues are hip dysplasia, elbow dysplasia, various eye problems, and heart disease. How much would a golden retriever cost? Lots of potential puppy parents want to know about the golden retriever price that they can expect to pay before they decide to add a new furry friend to their family. You can expect a golden retriever price to be about $1,000 to $3,500 when you purchase from a quality breeder. Can I leave my golden retriever home alone? Golden retrievers can be left alone as long as they are cared for and not neglected. Adult golden retrievers can be left alone for up to four hours. They definitely should not be left for eight hours. Leaving a young puppy for too long is also cruel as they need pee breaks, stimulation, food, and water. Are male or female golden retrievers better? It's a matter of preference. Males do mature physically faster than females, especially when it comes to potty training. Because of this, most females are easier to obedience train than males. They normally have their commands down sooner than male English goldens. At what age does a golden retriever calm down? When do golden retrievers calm down? Golden retrievers are a hyper dog breed. However, like most dogs, they tend to calm down after their puppy phase, around two or three years old. Golden retriever females of the breed tend to mature faster obedience-wise than males, so they are more likely to be calmer overall. Do golden retrievers destroy furniture? Golden retrievers tend to chew items wherever you are not in the room especially when you fail to provide enough chewing materials. They usually destroy couches and clothes. Thus, it is crucial as an owner you provide enough chewing sponges and bones to prevent them from lurching on your items like seats and slippers. Which type of golden retriever is best? There is no best type of golden retriever because all of them are the same breed. All three types are energetic and easy to train, can serve as guide dogs, and behave in the same way. Ultimately, you should base your decision on personal preference and choose a dog that will fit into your family and lifestyle. Are male or female golden retrievers better? It's a matter of preference. Males do mature physically faster than females, especially when it comes to potty training. Because of this, most females are easier to obedience train than males. They normally have their commands down sooner than male English goldens. What age are golden retrievers most difficult? The most difficult is usually between 8 and 18 months, which is when most dogs are surrendered to rescues and shelters. During this stage, it can be difficult for owners to be patient and consistent with training while waiting for this stage to pass. Do Golden Retrievers Smell? No, not all Golden Retrievers smell bad. However, the breed is known for being prone to developing odor. This is especially true if your Golden is in the water a lot or if he has a lot of fur. Their coat can harbor dirt, bacteria, and other things that can cause them to smell bad, even fishy at times. That's all for today. I hope you liked the video. So don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative and amazing videos.